from the start. We'll get the individual player introductions for the Russians in just a moment. They're unchanged from yesterday's straight sets win. Players still feeling fresh after putting Trinidad and Tobago to the sword very quickly. Irina Koroleva, the uh, number six, will lead them out. Nine points for her yesterday, including an incredible six stuff blocks to lead all players on uh, day one here in Kobe in that department. She'll celebrate her 27th birthday on the final day of this first stage on Thursday. Presentation of the starting players, liberals, and coaches. Mazwa, Team Russia. Number six, Irina Koroleva. Pulling out, so Koroleva will be the number eight. Natalia Goncharova, a team with 13 points yesterday. 12 of 20 spikes for 60% efficiency. Number 13, Number 13 of Jenny Stotsko is the captain. Plenty of previous experience at World Championships and Olympics. Number, Number 14, 14 is Fetisova. Plays with the Russian champions to the Moscow. Number 16, and Irina Vorokova works 16, played at the Rio Olympics, but her first World Championships had nine Number points 18, yesterday. Ksenia Parubets. A 23-year-old spike at 10 Libero, points yesterday, 10 of 19 on spike for 53% efficiency. The head coach is Vadim Pankov. Head coach. Galkina, the Libero wearing Pankov. number nine. A look at the tight starting lineup. Two changes for them. Pompoon Gaypard coming in. Alongside Malikar Kanton. Tyrand. Number three, Pompoon Gupard. Pompoon Gepard, the first player to come out, the number four behind number her is Tadeo Nuremberg. The biggest block reach on the tie roster had two stuff blocks yesterday. The captain wearing five is Pia Jatinka, seven points yesterday, four aces and three stuff blocks from her. Wearing 15, 15 is Malakar Kanton, one of those two changes. The number 16 is the 20 year old Pimpi Chaya Cochran, 25 points on her competition debut. In the win over career, 64% spike efficiency. And 18 is I Charaporn Konyot, who and plays with the tight champion two, Supreme. Danai Sri Wachami Tackle is the head coach for Thailand. There we go then, two teams looking for a second straight win to start these championships. That would put them in a superb position from which to build towards the next round. It is a seven-time world champion in Russia, taking on a two-time Asian champion in Thailand. The Russians will start on serve with their captain, Evgenia Startsva. Take the first point as well. The swipe into the net from Thailand. It's a big hit on the far side from Kong Yok, another look, young, impressive player, just 23. Oh, oh. Also flies too long beyond the baseline, though. Russia ahead, two to one. Be really interesting to see if uh, those young Thai players can raise their games against the Russians here this evening, particularly Pimpichaya Kokran, who scored those 25 points yesterday. Also interesting to see how much they've got left in the tank after that five setter. 
in the final match last night. We've got Russia on the ropes a little here on this offense and a big attack from the backcourt. Kong Yot shut down. Chance to set a game for Thailand. So much power, it almost touched the lights in the arena. And the swipe from the Russians on the far side too long. Thailand working hard to keep up early on. Try again from that side, and this time it sticks for Parubets. 10 out of 19 on Spike yesterday, 53% for the 23-year-old. Right to the back court from Malikar Kanton. Repaying the uh, faith put in her by her coach, given the start today for the first time at these championships. Put the chair of Cochran to serve. Mister <laughs> attacking from the near side this time with Goncharova. Backs it to the far side. Cochran stopped. Now on the near side, they'll try across to the far sideline. Did it touch the line? No. As Malakar Kanton looked to score again. Denied by a monster block. One of Russia's big hitters shut down. Great diving save from the Thai Libero, Payroy. Now attack from the backcourt, but the Russian block this time in the way. A really energetic and fascinating start back and forth in this first set. Russia just had the edge. Parubets, who was blocked a few points ago, this time getting in the way and taking revenge. <laughs> Thailand firing straight back. Cherupo and Kongyot, who started very well. Thailand, an equal match for the seven-time world champions over the first ten points. Leonjit Tink out to serve, the captain for Thailand. A big kick from Goncharova. Led Russia in scoring yesterday. She's emphatically up and running here today as well. The most capped player on the Russian roster, 121 coming into this tournament. Experience at multiple World Championships and the Olympics. There's Konyon again, they keep going to the number 18 and she keeps on delivering. Got three. They have Thailand six. Off balance that time, Cochrane. And the defense allowed time to get across to the far side. The set was off the mark. Cochrane had to try and adjust, and it just allowed that extra half a second or so. For Fatisova and Voronkova to sew together. Hey. Oh. 
and serve. Flies all the way through, though. And beyond the baseline, 7-7. The next point will take us into the technical timeout, but who's going to have the lead? And Charupon Kongyok for Thailand. Rankovar who scores the point for Russia and takes them into the technical timeout with a slight edge. But uh, Thailand have been energetic and enthusiastic and provided some moments of real quality of their own across these opening 15 points. <laughs> will know that they are in for a potentially rough ride here tonight. It certainly won't be as easy for them as it was against the tournament debutants Trinidad and Tobago yesterday. Attack flying over the three meter line to finish and to tie the ties level. And Charaporn Kongyot again, she's got four of their eight. <laughs> A big double block for Thailand to take the lead. Tinkat the captain alongside Kong Tong. Getting up and slamming the defensive door in the face of Russia's leading scorer from yesterday, Goncharova. Here comes Goncharova again. Accepting the responsibility of uh, picking her and her team back up to get level again. Backcourt attack once more for Thailand, stopped over the net and finished. Straight away on the first time volley back over. Guess who? Balls in the trouble. Whereas uh, Kong got the number 18, but finishing off her captain, Pujit Tinkau. Barry Betts. Barry's one at the feet of the defense, and we're level at 10-10. Stopped again. The block stuffed back in the face of Koroleva. Not for the first time, Goncharova has been shut down on the big spike attempt at the net. She'll try again, and she goes too long. This time, and it got in front of a few more of them. The defence did well to duck out the way of that one. Thailand by two for the first time. 
Androva misfiring right now. She'll have to recover this one. They're too far beyond the baseline. Thailand 13, seven-time world champions, Russia 10. And the Reds have been rocked. And Vadim Pankov calls timeout. Четче при не надо болтать руками. Ты прекрасно принимаешь. Зачем ты сейчас болтаешь? Просто удержать в знаке мяч и все. Этого достаточно мы выиграем. Чтобы мы не проиграли мяч. Понимаете? 13 очков. Внимание! Давай, Есть! Давай, давай, давай. Давай, давай. Well, their team have come out firing. She hasn't. Not yet, anyway. There's a long time to go. Get on top in this rally as well for the big attempt and the score. Four in a row for Thailand. The baby back set from Porn Poon Gepard and a finish inevitably from Kong Yot. Bets only into the net. And Thailand have five in a row. They can't believe it. They've been the best supported team so far here in Kobe for the first stage. And they are repaying their fans right now. A double change for Russia. Tatiana Romanova coming on alongside Dario Malegina for the first time in this tournament. Romanova set to the far side, Malegina hit it. Thailand will deliver it back against the triple block and out of bounds. Surge to take them into the technical timeout on a real high. Thailand is showing that they have some real strength in depth as well. I Charapor and Kongyok only had two points in the 3-2 win yesterday. She only started one set, came on as a substitute in one more. She started the match here and been by far and away the best scorer on the court. Six points now. against the Libero. Big right hand, just about kept up. Romanova had to help it over. And that's right back into the back corner. It's a magnificent seven for Thailand without reply. Russia doing their best to keep up. But to no avail on that occasion, finished off by Pliomjit. Just inside the baseline. An ace 
ace from Cantor. And this has been an ace performance so far from Thailand. Over. Back in business and back with a bang. She went to the bench, Goncharova, after a really difficult spell. And she was rejected twice. Stopping a run of eight straight points. Tin Cow responds to extend the lead back to eight. Kept <laughs> alive really well by Canton, who's performed well coming into the starting lineup. Wonkova denied again. Tipped over the top of the triple block. Russia will attack with Goncharova to score back to back. Points for her. They still trail by seven, Russia. Starts for the setter, picking out the leading scorer. reacted well right at the net and that's how Russia earned a point had she not touched that it would have been a glorious opportunity for Thailand just to tip it over for perhaps an easy score Russia have scored two in a row and Thailand wants to talk it over the Thai coach puts three Wachame tackle in charge since 2016. He was previously an assistant for both the men's and women's teams. He'll be absolutely delighted with the start that his players have made here. Another big, big block. They part and New York Jang alongside each other. Thailand to 20 and in style. Ronkova stopped. Incredible defense in terms of trying to get to the loose ball, but one such too many in the end from Thailand. They're playing with a real spring in their step and smiles on their faces. They have such a never say die attitude to reaching the ball. And the deflection that Russia were hoping for. Nothing going their way at the moment for Ronka. Got a big, strong piece of this one, but not the right direction. Off the right hand, out of bounds for a tie point again. They're just four away now from taking this first set. That's the deflection they wanted on the block. Fetisova alongside Gotcharova. Really tight double block. 
off the left elbow of Fatisova. Russia in need of a run. Fatisova stops off the top of the block, close to the net. Tipped down and in by Goncharova. Back to back points, they still trail by five. Right over the top of the net, Goncharova. Panoy overhead, had to be helped over. Russia able to set. Goncho Rover starting to find her feet as she gets some super height. Four points the gap now. Goncho Rover involved in three in a row. through down the line to take Thailand one giant step closer to sealing this first set they only need three more past Ale Galkina the libero in the backcourt Galkina fielding that one Paru Betts with power Russia can set Combination attack, Paru Betts finishes it off. The Russians picking the right point to go on a run. Across court and in. Right on the line, and the tie is right on the mark. And set one. Yes. Yes. delivers again. She started well and then faded. Now she's swinging again. Five set points for Thailand. They have been superb in set one. Russia inevitably will call timeout. One more point required for Thailand to secure would be a huge, huge set for them. After a 3-2 win last night, can they take the lead tonight against the seven-time world champions? Not just yet, the first of those five set points saved by Irina Koroleva. They are not dead yet. Power 
Robets with the ace. They need three more. Twenty-four, twenty-one. Set point number three to come for Thailand. Absolutely no room for error in terms of this first set on serve for Ksenia Parubets, who scored an ace on the last one. Runcher <laughs> over, over the top. Great stop from Panoy, and they've done it. Thailand take the set against the seven-time world champions, Russia. What a position they put themselves in, in front of their passionate fans here in Kobe. Russia with a bit of a retaliation to try and close the gap after Thailand burst away across the midway point of that set. But the Thais able to finish the job. And so, so impressively behind the eight points of a Cheraporn, but a number of big contributors. Malik Carr with six, Leonjit the captain with three. And there is plenty to talk over on the Russian bench right now. Start take off for Thailand here at the Kobe Green Arena on match day two as they take the first set against the most successful team in the history of this competition. And in the six previous world championship matches that Thailand have won the first set, they've gone on to win five of them. Russia have been rocked and rattled and now need to respond. First set, taken in 28 minutes, 25-21. Thailand doing a great job on offense of getting a number of scorers involved, but also on defensive. Blocking Goncharova on a few occasions, she still ended up the leading scorer on the Russian roster with seven. And they're well aware of her threat and have shown that they're capable of dealing with it to a certain extent. Let's see how well Russia can respond. Let's see as well if any sort of fatigue does set in for those Thai players who played the full five sets and two as and a quarter hours last night.
Rush along the first blow of set two. There's a new power bets backpedaling and then attacking at the net. Over the top of the double block. from Russia. Parabets involved along with Koroleva. for who was trying to get out of the way of it. Thailand aggressively up and running. Off the big kick from Kongyong. of letting Russia go on a run at the start of the set. Pimpi Chaya Kokram, their big scorer yesterday, scores a big point here today. Power bets with power. Absolutely smashed that one down and against the hands of her opponent. Trover could it follow up on the serve though, only finding the net. Certainly not comfortable watching on the moment for Coach Pankav. Nice, <laughs> what a serve, dropping in low from Tata Nuek Jan. Completely deceiving the defence. Way out of reach in front of Varankova. Power bets again, showing what she's all about from this wing. On the strong side, the right hand attack coming in against the single blocker as well. She was taking no prisoners. Cross court, but wide of the line. That time from Malikar Kontong. Russia ahead, five to four. Paru bets to serve. <laughs> Tremendous dive from Galkina to keep it going for Russia. Blocks in the way and able to find the line as well. Plenty of time for two of them to get across there. And for Koroleva to get her hands up and over. And now again, this time we use the blocker. In the front left position going across to centre. Boronk over there, alongside Corey Labour in the middle. Harry Betts or Boronk over rather against the net. Bunch of over. Challenge at the net from Koroleva. No way through for Thailand right now. Now 
able to play off the hands of the blocker there. Enough power to take it through the block, which wasn't penetrating the net. Out comes for Ronkova. And uh, into the game comes uh, Anna Kortikova, an 18 year old, the only teenager on the Russian roster. Over stopped again. Thailand with back to back points and back within touch. And I'm off the top of the net. Just off the underside of the arms of the two Thai blockers. the game and denied almost instantly. Paul Pook part with the rejection of the 18-year-old. Yeah. Oh, rejecting that one though from Coral Ava. Russia have the slightest of edges. And the technical timeout, eight to seven. Нельзя пускать туда. Это просто нельзя. Иначе мы играем в толпу за маленький волейбол. Вот высота. Только высоко через пальцы я укажу. То же самое, Ира Воронкова. Бьем не вниз, а бьем высоко. Natalia Goncharova has been so heavily involved so far. She's been through purple patches and poor patches. Kenny, big scorer, who's uh, taking up a leading role and a leading team. She's got the confidence to keep coming again, and just to keep on swinging. Russia have to take that attitude as a team to come back strong and turn this match on its head. Marina Koroleva to serve their lead by one in the second set. Tikova with power deflected back so kindly for Thailand that. And then drill toe by the clinical captain. Tinkau take off. Thailand level 8-8. Eight, eight. So following that straight into the net though, Russia back ahead. If it remains this tight towards the end of set two, Russia really will be playing under pressure. from the backcourt too long. Not very often she fails to connect like that. A decent set to her. She got the height. She did not get the accuracy. Matisseva <laughs> right on top of the net scores. Need the team able to score a point on their serve at the moment. We keep alternating between a one point Russian lead and a tie. <laughs> Off the 
side of the block for the tie again. Nothing to separate these two over the first 20 points of set two. And off the right hand of Goncharova out of bounds. Tisova with a rocket of a right hand. Right into the backcourt and the pattern continues. Tisova to try and stop it on serve now. <laughs> Once more, we have a tie game. More, we have a point from a Charaport. She becomes the first player in the match up to double figures, the number 18. Yeah. Yeah. Just over the top of the block. And push it back ahead through Goncharova. Again, Goncharova, but only firing into the net this time. 12-12 now. Not since 5-7 have we had consecutive points scored in this second set. We have now, though, Thailand ahead for the first time. First time they've led since fourth in this second set. Paru Betts off the mark. Another one into the net. This time Gonja Rober. Russia's two main weapons misfiring. Thailand by two, 14-12. And Russia will call a timeout to try and turn the tide. Но нападать надо. Не бьем под себя, высоко, мощно нападает. Низко скажи выше, мне сейчас все равно. Да, девочки, спокойно. Сейчас решаем, спокойно, да, снимаемся, решаем. Все, внимательно, счет. Пошли. They have been magnificent so far, resilient and uh, surprisingly full of energy after what they went through last night. And an ace on serve as well off the back of that timeout. Nuek Jack with one that Kortikova couldn't stop. That's another tie point to take them into the technical timeout. No touch on the shot. Russia looked early in this second set like they'd responded, but. It's come off the rails for the Russians. We are going to have a challenge, so it may well be that we're not there yet. Russia to challenge, presumably for a block touch. Well, there wasn't one. A slight delay, Thailand can celebrate. Into the technical timeout. 
with a 16-12 lead. Thailand on a run of five unanswered points to come from one down to lead by four. Russia surely cannot afford to concede the first two sets. Tap down to it, Jang to serve. Against the net again from Parubet, she'll line another one up over the top of the block this time. Out to the near side, now to bounce off the block, the run goes on. Six in a row for Thailand, the 20-year-old Pimpi Chaya Kokram scoring the latest. As Russia looked to stop the rock. Down by four still. There is time to come back in this set. They need to improve though. They will rely so much on her. Power bets as well, who's to serve next. Another one off the block for Thailand. Another car kept on. Fans who've braved the bad weather to get here being rewarded. Really well dug out by Thailand. They blocked the next one as well. We should go again. Not to Kortekova. Did it get a touch? No. It's another tie point, a six-point lead at 19-13. Russia are going to challenge it again. They failed in their last challenge for a block touch. How about this one? Coach Vadim Pankav and his team need something. No touch again. touch, no joy, maybe no sets. Russia facing the prospect of losing the first two. Kortikova comes out, Kortikova comes back in. The task can set for the big hit. 2013, they're only five points away. Tinkau, the captain, close to the net, doing the damage this time. They've all stepped up, they've all played their part. Romanova and Maligina coming in for Russia here. Desperate need of something, and uh, Veronica provides it. Now can the Russians build off that and go on a run? For a lever to serve. Oh, what a take 
off from the three-meter line. Drilled home by Kong Yak. There's a huge storm outside this arena. And it's been a Thai typhoon in it. The Russians rocked. as well it seems almost inevitable now that Thailand can take a 2-0 lead Varankova unable to handle the serve and Russia unable to handle the pressure Out of 15 against Russia in world level majors. They haven't got this one just yet. Not by a long way. Parubet's getting plenty of height and plenty of power. Runcher over back in after a brief rest. Starts for two. Romanova and Malikina out. They need the captain serve from Startsford. Runcher over. A chance for Thailand to serve. And another point. Malikar Kantong, what a big performance from her coming into the starting lineup. Nine points now. The second leading scorer in the match. Behind Aichara Porn's 11. to weather the storm that's come their way. Thailand with nine set points. In time, the 20-year-old Pimpi Chaya Kokram adding to her tally. The first of those nine set points saved. Surely they can't dig it out from here, though, Russia. There's a fault here. Which way is the point going to go? It's Russia's. They're back within seven. We are going to have a timeout to try and see Thailand over the finish line in this second set. Now can they take on the instructions of coach Danai? Let's try watching my tackle and execute. One point away from a two set to love lead. Terrific ties take the first two. 25 17 here. Their traveling fans can barely believe what they're witnessing. Russia need a big regroup after a 25 21 first set, 25 17 to Thailand in the second. 
Thailand playing at the Asian Championships, winning a couple of those continental titles, but here at the World Championships, only their fifth ever appearance. And they lead the seven-time world champions, Russia, by two sets to zero. Kobe Green Arena, where Thailand have just taken the second set, 25-17, having won the first set as well, 25-21 against Russia. Two more points in that second set from attack kits. Two fewer on Brock, but three more on serve and five more off the errors of their opponents. Thailand lead by two sets to love. A real turn up for the Bucks here. Thailand had all of their matches at the last World Championships decided in straight sets and only won one out of the five. Russia, who have not won, or not failed to win their second match of the World Championships since 2002, now have to win three straight sets if they're to keep that run going. Only one set away from making it back-to-back -back World Championship wins for just the second time in their five appearances in the competition. The previous time was back in 2010 when they had consecutive wins against Kazakhstan and Croatia. This would be something a little different. And they're ahead in set three. Lightning bolt to the line. Point precision. That serve didn't quite match. Noted too long. 1 1 and set three. Set three. They've been excellent in every department so far. Playumjit, the captain, with the final touch. Great cohesion at the net, though. We knew they had fight. We knew they had team spirit. Not sure we knew they had this quality. Both of Russia's points so far in set three have come off. Errors on the serve from Thailand now, Nuek Jang into the net. Yeah, 
Set that one right back from Fatissima. The Russian roster and the Russian bench just haven't had the answers yet to the questions that Thailand have posed. Gonchar over, denied. They'll come again. Here she goes once more, and this time make sure she sinks it. Over. Up to double figures. The first Russian to get there. <laughs> Off the top of the net, recovered by the Libero. Controver trying to help it over the block. We'll save it in the back door. Saved by Gontrova down on the deck this time. Paro bets to fire towards the baseline. Thailand with the back set, cross court. Gontrova down again. Paro bets tipping over the top. A chance to set close to the net this time and to finish a huge rally in style. Leonja Tinkau. And Thailand are relentless. 5-3 they lead in set three. on the angle, bringing Russia back within one. Ksenia Paro bets now up to nine. And Charo Porn for Thailand leads the way on 12. Rover with so much power and deflects up off Pia Nupanoi and into the fans in the front row. Plenty of anger behind that one from the frustrated Russian. Somehow back over off the face of Panoi and then out of bounds, but no, there was a touch. How close was that? Ever so close, Hanoi. Still seeing stars, though, after taking a pile driver to the face. Too long on the following point from Manikar Kantok. Russia have been able to claw their way back ahead here. It's four points without reply now from the Russians. Off the top of the block and in. Make it five in a row to reach the technical timeout with a three-point lead. Russia have finally responded. The first technical foul. Эти больше в линию бейте сюда в пятую зону. Скидывать вообще нельзя. Сейчас надо нападать. Понятно. Лучше отыграться к себе. Плохой мяч контроля. Вернуть и сыграть снова. Они все достают это. Сюда можно кинуть, но это надо с высоты попасть на таз вот сюда. У тебя не страхуют, кстати. Тебя не играют защиту. Тебе можно. Можешь с высоты. Look back at the history of Russia and the Soviet Union. The most successful nation in the history of women's volleyball. Four Olympic gold medals, seven world championships. 19 goals at the European Championships. And here Thailand are, so far, taking them apart, but 
Russia in the third set, a must-win third set. And uh, finally been able to show their best. And that one in, despite being hurdled by Cochrane. And it makes it six without reply for Russia, their best run of the match. Seven in a row. They trailed 5-3. Now they lead 10-5. Timeout called by Thailand. And now we're starting to see why Russia are ranked fifth in the world, why they are the seven time world champions. And Thailand need to respond to the challenge. Russia have wrapped it up a notch. And a big block on the far side. Barankova and Koroleva. The number six and 16 giving them a six-point lead. It's now an eight-point run without reply. Make it nine in a row for Russia. Where on earth has this come from? All of a sudden, they're running away with it. For the first time in the match, the ties look a little confused, and they are going to call another timeout to try and stop the bleeding. It's by far and away the best patch of the match for this Russian team. They really struggled through sets one and two. And rapidly picked up pace in set three. on track for now. They stopped the run of nine unanswered points. Off the back set to Honoma City Rack. Draw the cross court by Veronkova. Converted eight out of 11 spike attempts yesterday en route to nine points. Try to get another one back. They need to go on a run at some stage now in this third set though. They want to claim a strength sets victory. and still can't dampen the spirits in the Thai camp. Oh. 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 Now they're trading points. 
and that is only good enough for one of these two teams. court tonight 13 points now although that might well be her first one of this third set the big Russian defensive wall in the way had to be helped over by City Rack Venture over adjusting save flying down Russia rotating, Gontrova retreating and then attacking again. The backboard attack for Thailand, saved on the baseline. And sent towards Varankova, who fires long. And no touch. There is going to be a challenge to that call, though, from the Russian bench. Was this attempt touched by the Thai blocker? It was. Nick off the right thumb of the jumping defender. The point overturned. And Russia now leading by 15 points to eight. <laughs> Wan Pinyapong coming on for Thailand. And Jarova firing strong all the way through. Russia by eight now, the technical timeout. And it looks in near certainty that we're going to be heading to a fourth set. Goncharova now up to 12 points, the leading Russian, the second leading scorer in the match behind Nychera Porn. Paru bets in double figures for the Russians as well with 10. Yemjit on seven, the Thai captain. But eight points behind in this third set, and they won the first two. The challenge for Thailand is having played five sets, and two and a quarter hours last night, they might have to go the distance again tonight. Rotation from the coach key to keeping people fresh. Bets. To back up, but misjudged at the net. And despite being down by nine, being battered and bruised in this third set, they're still in such a good mood, the Thai players out there. And another big block for Tisava. Shutting down Aichara Porn Kongyok. She's the leading scorer in the match, but just one of her 13 points coming here in the third set. Little to no joy for her in set three, nor for Thailand. off the top of the block. Backcourt attack, touched over the top brilliantly. 
was a readjustment in midair. I don't think that was the initial intention. Not quite on the same wavelength as the setter. It's just a little out of reach and had to stretch for it. And that helped to elevate the ball over the top of the front line of the defense. Bets across court with power. Russia by double figures. Runja <laughs> answering back with a big spike of her own. with a few more of those here in set three. Goncharova <laughs> drilling one diagonally back to the back corner. And Russia hit the 20 point mark here. Has gone to Robert. Makes it 13 in the match. <laughs> Tangle attack for Thailand. Up into the air. That's a power back. It's a fault though from Russia. He's still in a comfortable and commanding position in set three. Korolaver, Russia only four points away. They're looking a strong position now to come back and not just try and win a set, but turn the match completely around and go on and win three in a row. Just looks so much stronger than Thailand. And the longer this one goes on, with Russia still in it, it will suit him and his team because Thailand played those long minutes yesterday. You can see that they're more weary here in set three. Russia is certainly up their game as well. Going up and firing on through the hands of the blocker. Surely just a consolation point though in the scope of this third set. <laughs> so now kept alive by Thailand. Russia to go again and to finish them off through Korolaver. That's a tight defensive effort in vain. Korolaver with the knockout blow. That one just about caught the line across court. Russian retaliation. Frankova with velocity. Down to the deck. And Russia with 11 set points to get back in this match.
There you go. Got Jarova. What an emphatic response from the Russians. 25-13 in a must-win third set. Vadim Pankev getting the response he wanted. Goncharova scoring a handful of points again. And Thailand need a rethink after excelling in sets one and two, 25-21, 25-17. Russia take set three with the most dominant margin of the match so far by 12 points, 25-13. It's another must-win set to come, but they have the wind in their sails. Thailand lead by two sets to one now here at the Kobe Green Arena having taken the first two Russia able to win the third and to take us to set four now the challenge is to win the fourth and take us all the way again here on the final match on this court for the second straight night at the start of these world championships <laughs> A look at the stats and Russia dominant in set three by 12 points seven more points on attack hits two more on block one more on serve two more on opponents errors how could they keep it going in set four will Thailand continue to wilt under the fatigue and the pressure or will they find their second wind Goncharova leading the charge for the seven-time world champions with 14 points. Her teammates Paru Betts and Koroleva also in double figures with 12 and 10 respectively. But uh, leading the way of all scorers is still the Thai number 18, Icharaporn Kongyot, who's got 15 so far. Nobody else in double figures though for Thailand. Tisa that setting the Russian stall out at this start of set four. It was a big hit that was only just dug out and then she got across to make the block as well. Robert shut down. Then had to help it over. Thailand to set and to score as well, all the way through off the cheek of Veronica. One one at the start of the fourth. Jarova rocking the defense with a rasp. A 
scoring lead from Coronava. A quick set over the top of the net from Startsford. And then the big spike from the number six. That goes by Carl Canton. And uh, back in comes one of our city rack. The team's second best 16 points yesterday. She didn't start this one though. Of course, the coach having to think about rotation. Given that uh, remember, the players played the vast majority of the five sets yesterday. City Rat was one of the players that he took out. over delicately and delightfully placed down the line in between the two lines of defense cylinders despite playing most of uh, last night's game scoring 25 points up to double figures in this one again <laughs> carbon copy of just a few points to go the leap from Coraleva right over the top of the net Again, off the set from starts for the captain facilitating her number six finishing. Black is moving across well, Bush is serving it off the net. Over the top of the block this time, and out to the reach of Startsford on the far side. Somehow kept alive off the diving intervention from Coraleva off the net. Not kept alive for too long. City Rack to serve. Over. Stopped on the far side despite the power. There she comes again from the backcourt, again against the body of City Rack, again. They're able to survive despite being rocked against the ropes by the Russians. City Rack to touch it. Forced back over again by the diving Galkina. Across court and through. What a point for Thailand to Thai level. Tremendous defense to stop Goncharova throwing those big right hands. And then in the end, it was the Russian number eight who couldn't handle the one that came back at her from Pimpi Chaya Kokram, the 20 year old. They're not going to keep that one alive, though. Too high for the Libero. Patra Payroy on the far side to deal with the hit from Varonkova. Russia leads six to five. Varonkova <laughs> just directing it on the block out of bounds. Thailand tie level, City Rack. Getting the point. Talk about her being tired perhaps after yesterday. She attempted a whopping 51 spikes in that five setter last night. She only converted 15 of them, 29%. Goncharova, how many has she attempted tonight? 
She certainly landed a higher proportion. 17 points now to tie level with a Charaporn. It's five more than anybody else on the floor from those two. Stats showing there. 22 spike attempts seems like a lot. To think that uh, City Rack attempted 51. That's, that's a huge number. There goes Parry Betts from the cross court set to rifle one home. Russia with the edge at the technical timeout, leading 8 to 7. A rest day for these two nations to come tomorrow. Their team will certainly need it after five sets last night and at least four sets. Thailand resume on Tuesday when they face Trinidad and Tobago. The USA on Wednesday and Azerbaijan on Thursday. As for Russia, it's Azerbaijan Tuesday, Korea Wednesday. And the USA in the big one on Thursday. Roberts against the block, just landing out of bounds. Roberts, the third leading scorer in the match, up to 14 points now. So much power that time down the line. Unstoppable. Fatisova didn't know what had hit her. And the block in. Goncharova needs a rethink. Two getting across to stop it off the left hand of City Rack. That time she stopped in the backcourt. City Rack against the other side of the block, which was able to penetrate over the net and direct the ball down and onto the tie side of the floor. Kuncherova failing on a previous couple of spike attempts, getting the point on block that time. Long and no touch, although Russia are going to dispute that call. All of them seem convinced. We're quickly going to find out. 
10-10 as it stands. It's gone down as a tie point. If it's overturned, it will be an 11-9 Russian lead. There is a touch off the middle finger of tap down Nuek Jang, the number four. Russia 11, Thailand 9. This must win fourth set for the Russians. Country over, their star player on serve. Went back towards the baseline, Panoy didn't want to leave it. Panoy bets over the top, into the backcourt. Miss swing from Koraleva, it fell over the net though. And then touched over the top by Inuit Jan. Thailand back in touch. Well, Russia, we know, went on a huge run to run away with the third set. It looks like this one is going to be closer. Bets fires into the net. We are dead level at 11. Gone to Rover. Really well fielded. We'll come back at Russia. They're scrambling to keep it alive. The chance to set right on top of the net. And for Thailand to take the lead three in a row. They still believe they can win this one and take all three points. We are going to have a timeout here with Thailand having come from two points down to lead 12 <laughs> Just a reminder of the situation here, Thailand hoping for a 3-1 win, which will give them three points in the pool standings. A 3-2 win for either of these nations if it went to a fifth set would only be for a two-point reward. The losing team in that situation would get one point. And if Russia lose 3-1, they won't get any points. Thailand got two yesterday for their 3-2 win. Cross court and wide of the sideline. Thailand by two. Off the mark from Parabets. Again, the height of Koraleva. She's the second tallest on the Russian roster at 1 meter 94. She's used it to such good effect on several occasions now here in the fourth. Joy to the back corner by Varonkova. And the Russians have got back level, 13-13 now.
all the way through from Pimpichai and Cochrane with a couple of touches along the way. Thailand back ahead, 14-13. To 25 points yesterday, she's up to 14 today. Romanova has come in for Starksford as the Russians change their setup. Or rather, the other way around, they get level 14 14. Again, the 20 year old landing one right back to the back corner. Pimpi Chaya Cochram taking her tally to 15. Two of those in quick succession here in the fourth. City Rack serve. Fatisima fielding. Voronkova helping it over, looking to cover it, her downed teammate. <laughs> Thailand to set across to the far side, Russia have a chance to set themselves. Voronkova off the top of the block for the score. 15-15, nothing to separate these two. Over the first 30 points of set four. This team in a real battle here to try and go 2-0 and at the start of these championships. One thing we know for certain is that the USA will lead the Pool C pack at the end of match day two. They'll be the only team who can take maximum points. Well, oh, she's starting to catch fire. Pimpi Jaya Cockram. She takes Thailand into the technical timeout with a 16-15 lead. She's got three points. In quick succession now, she drills through the two players in the front line. Pimpi Jaya Cockram has burst towards the top of the top scorer's chart now, just one behind her teammate, Icheraporn Kongyot, and the Russian number eight, Goncharova. She has 17, Pimpichai Cochran 16. Most significantly, Thailand have 16 here in set four. They lead by one. Not for long though, Leomjik Tinkau serving into the net. We are dead level. She had four races yesterday, Tinkau. As a team, Thailand have only had two today. City Rack firing so long beyond the baseline. It wasn't a touch though. Or was that? I'm thinking about a challenge. It's rare that a big spike attempt would be that far beyond the baseline. It landed yards over. Was it a touch to take it there? Oh, no, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. Good job, the Russian blocker. Picked her fingernails this morning. It was that close. Yeah. That's the net from Voronkova on serve. 
17-17 now. This is looking like the tightest set of all four. Pompoon Gapard comes out and in comes the number 13, Nutsara Tomkom. Alive by Luet Jack down on her knees. Russia drilling it though through Goncharova down the line for the lead. It was far too close for comfort for the Russians, but they do have the edge in this must win set. Oh, Bushkin are in off the bench for the first time, replacing Fatisova. <laughs> City rack over the top. And touched over at the net by Nuet Jack. 18-18. So much power down the line from Goncharova, who's taken on so many attempts in this one, but still firing on all cylinders. Unstoppable of the set from Startsford. She drove it straight at the Libero. So Panther Payroy in the backcourt. And serve as well for Goncharova. Russia's sixth ace of the match gives them the slightest bit of breathing room late in the fourth, 20 to 18, timeout called by Thailand. Well, Natalia Goncharova has been the ace in the pack for Russia in this comeback. She's up to 20 points now. The tie's pegged back. And contemplating the possibility of a second, fifth set on this court in the space of as many days. Goncharova remains on serve. Great response from Cochran down the line to the back corner to half the deficit. They still believe they can finish this in four. Nuit Jan goes to the bench for Thailand. And uh, in for the first time comes Chachuan Mokstri, an 18-year-old. What a block to take Thailand level. The captain combining with one of the star scorers at the net. Cochram and Tinkau. And Thailand looking to take charge down the stretch. Timeout called by Russia this time. Well, this is the World Championships, and these teams are going to have to get used to playing in high pressured situations. Especially uh, Russia, who had real aspirations of making it all the way to the final six and challenging for the world title again. Thailand perhaps a little bit less pressure, given their lower expectations. 
And it's gone Jerova, who has the whole weight of expectancy on her shoulders to provide the scoring, but steps up and does just that. Over again, stop deep this time. Cochran to line one up. Parubets to keep it alive on the baseline. Gonchar over to unload again. Dug out from right down on the deck. City rack over the top of the defense. Gonchar over keeps it up. Starts for the set to this near side. It lands low and too low to recover. Veronima City rack down on the front underneath the net. And Russia lead by two. Scoring back-to-back -back points off the back of that big timeout. 22-20. And now a timeout for Thailand. Thailand down by two, Russia three points away from sending this all the way to set number five. Boomporn Gaypard comes back in, out goes the number 13, Luke Sarah Tomkom. Fans on their feet to celebrate the tie point. A captain's intervention from Leonjit Tinkau. What a block. And at what a point in the fourth set. Gontrova will try again, but this time fires past the number five. Russia by two again, 23-21, and only two points away. It is tight and tense between Thailand and Russia. over the top of the block. Parabets helps it up off her knees. Starts for Tisset. Goncharova. Well, she went for power the previous point. That time she went for precision. And Russia has three set points. Goncharova to finish it, and she does. The Russians are back from the brink. We may well have a challenge, though, from Thailand. This ball was out, I think, so the call must have been a block touch. Let's see if there was one or not. And the challenge is for in out. Well, it was in. It was right on the line. First looks can be deceiving. Gontra over, though, rarely misses. It was placed with pinpoint precision from the Russian number eight. And their level at two sets each. And now, for the second night running on this court, and for the second straight match of the start of these championships for Thailand, 
we go to a first to 15, fifth and decisive set. Welcome back to the Kobe Green Arena, where we're going late again for the second night running at the start of these championships in Pool C. And for the second straight match for Thailand, we're heading to five sets. How much have they got left in the tank? She's got plenty left, it seems. Goncharova, she just keeps on coming. 25 points for Russia. And Pliamjit leading the Thai troops. The captain, one of three in double figures for them. Have they got enough left, though? They'll be absolutely delighted that it's a rest day tomorrow. After back-to-back -back five setters. Russia only contesting the short straight sets win yesterday. Should have more to give here in the fifth. But Thailand, well, they're a team that always dig deep and find something from somewhere. Yesterday's win was Thailand's first ever five-set match at the World Championships. Their previous 22 were all decided in three or four sets. They waited all that time for a five-setter, and then two come along on consecutive nights. Just a reminder that it's at first to 15 now rather than 25 if you are new to the sport. So each and every point has that little bit of added weight to it. And certainly, there's a lot of extra pressure. Arubet <laughs> stopped by the block. we will try from the other side. Goncho Rover, 26 points from her. It makes it the largest tally of any player on this court over the first two days of competition. She's doubled her own tally from yesterday. And she's carrying her team right now. Did that get a touch on its way through? City Rap thinks it did. The officials think it didn't. Wag of the finger from the number six, but will there be a challenge? It doesn't look like it. Batisova to serve. Arubets kept alive somehow by Hanoi. Russia with the chance. To help it over, Paribets again. Panel underneath it again. And right back to the back corner. Dropped from high overhead, but it was tremendous technique to watch it dropping out of the lights. And to swipe it all the way across to catch the corner of the court. Pimpichaya Cochram showing that it wasn't just a Flash in the pattern game last night. 17 points for her now. 
Thailand, Thai level. Look off the long hit from Parubex. We're going to have a challenge here from the Russian bench. Was there a touch along the way on this hit from the number 18, Kasenya Parubex? No, there wasn't. It is 2 2. The Russians with the momentum taking back to back sets to arrive here in the fifth, then winning the first two points of it. But Thailand have responded. Gancharova with the big kick. Ends up being a point, the fault on the reception. Clip at the top of the net there from the number 18, Kong Yacht. And touchdown and in by Koraleva, using her great height to her advantage again. And Russia lead by two again. Superstar on serve. Thailand survived that particular scare though. A block touch along the way, indicated by the official. The ball carried beyond the baseline for a tie point. Chirova, kept alive by City Rack this time. Pimpy Chai Cockram all the way through. On fire now, the 20 year old, up to 19 points. One team's leading scorer beating the others. This was really close. Just inside. There she goes again. This time Goncharova got the better of Kong Yok. Tip back over, Goncharova diving to save it again. Bronkova down with power, tremendous diving stop from Panoy. Bronkova goes again. Thailand able to repel the attack again. Goncharova wants more over the block. She's everywhere, peeing up Panoy, the Libero. Bronkova, this time kept up by Gabe Park. The hit from the three metre line though falls short from City Rec. And Russia get there in the end to lead 6-4. Being made to work so hard for each point. Delight on the Russian side of the floor. Such disappointment on the Thai side, having put so much in. We'll have another change. Well, another stoppage rather to the change of ends, which comes when the leading team hits eight points here in this first to 15 fifth set. So that might not be too far away. Russia leads six to four. Yeah. 
on to Rover. Stopped by City Rat. Draw the cross court again from Cochrane to Goncharova, who fields it and hits it. It's denied though. And Thailand half the arrears again. Beyond the reach of Galkina. Thailand back within one. for Russia. What a fortuitous break. Slammed into the face of Korolev, look at this. Came off her cheek and her shoulder. Cherubor and Kongyong. Beaten at the net. She looked a little sheepish about what had happened. Making changes here, two players coming in. And they'll look to get level before the change of ends. Tom Cobb is into the game, the number 13. And so to Canton, the number 15. Body shot from Goncho over. Dealt with by Thailand for now. Stopped, kept alive though by Panor. Brian Cover. Helped across to the far side for City Rack again, lofted over the block. Russia to set for Brian Cover again. Over the top, there's Panoy. Getting to everything right now. Incredible rally this one, deep in the fifth set. The captain through. Just over the top, Leonjit Tinkau and Thailand are level at 7-7. A quick release on the attack just at the top of the net. for the cheeks, a chance to catch your breath, they go again. A long rally, the last thing that Thailand need right now, but it's amazing how much energy you can get when you score the point. Barankovic makes short work of that one though and takes Russia into the change of ends with an 8-7 lead. across the midway point of the fifth and final set. Goncharova leading the way of all scorers with a whopping 27 points. Pimpi Chaya for Thailand, the number 16, just 20 years of age, with 19 points. The captain there, Pliumjit, with 12. Charaborn with 17. going to be a heartbroken defeat for one of these two. Venture over. 28 now for the number eight.
His team trail by two points. Russia six points away from completing what would be a very impressive comeback, having lost the first two sets of this one. to go yet. Yeah. City ranks Sizzler to take Thailand back to within a point. Goncharova looping towards the baseline but just beyond it now. Is potentially going to be a challenge again here. They reckon it found a piece of the line. 9-9 as it stands, Thailand back level, having been two behind. Is that the case though? Wow, look at that! By a whisker! Goncharova has not missed much tonight. And that was as close as could be. But she found the slightest slither of the court to extend her impressive tally up to 29 points. ahead by three now 11 to eight four points away from the five set win it's great to see Thailand still smiling but you would have to feel for them if they lost this one after the tremendous efforts of set one and set two of his tip dealt with. Contra over to help it up. City Rack stopped by Fatisova. All the way to the backcourt. Kept up by Galkina. It's another lengthy rally in another lengthy match for Thailand. But Russia come out on top. Irina Fatisova. And they're only three points away now. Three points away from winning three sets in a row. Goncharova! A thrilling 30 for her. There's a storm going across Kobe tonight, but it's been raining points for the number eight in Russian red. And there she goes again, stop this time. Kept alive somehow. Thailand just can't get it to stick. They will that one there. Four points behind. Russia, though, need just two more to finish the job. Nguyen Jang with the score. After Russia had unfathomably kept alive two previous attempts. Oh, 
Betts just beyond the baseline and look like. Didn't get in touch, didn't catch the line. We are going to have a challenge to find out. The point awarded to Russia, which would make it five set points for them here in the fifth. It was right onto the line again. And Russia have been right on their game over the last three sets. First of five match points now. Leo Bushkina on serve. Come back complete for the seven time world champions. Pushed to their limits by Thailand. Over five sets here tonight, but they come through in the end. Despite losing the first two sets, they win the final three to take two points. 25 21 to Thailand in the first, 25-17 impressively in the second, but his team winning the third, 25-13, the fourth, 25-21, and the fifth, a decisive set, 15-9. Tough to take for the Thais, who put so much in, and performed so well for such large parts of this long match, but it's the Russians who come out on top, digging deep, and showing the heart and character of a potential champion. It's great for their education. Get a tough test early on in this competition as they hope to go far, but certainly Thailand demonstrating that they have the character and the quality to go further than the first stage this time around as well. Two points for them for a 3-2 win last night. They get one point tonight as well for losing in five sets. And that may well stand them in good stead going forward over the final three matches. Russia led by Goncharova, the number eight, who had a monster game, 30 points. 27 of those on spike to lead Russia to victory. 103 to 93 overall. That's a fifth set going 20 minutes, despite being only first to 15. The fourth set lasting 31 minutes, the longest of the lot, as Russia were able to force their way over the finish line to get to the fifth. And from there, you had to feel the ball was very much in their court. They had the momentum and they had the extra energy.